After the Gracie family made their name, their cousins the Machado brothers also followed suit by coming to the United States. To showcase their family's style of the art, the brothers sought out grappling competitions rather than fighting. In a family of high-level black belts, it was tough to stand out as the most technical, but Jean-Jacques Machado did just that. His game was simple, attack, attack, and attack. Most of the time, it started with a guard pull, but from then on, it would be an onslaught of attacks. He chained together sweeps and submissions in a style that Jiu-Jitsu had not seen before. The winner of countless competitions in Brazil, what most grapplers remember Jean-Jacques for, would definitely be his performances at the early ADCC World Championships. In 1999, he won the gold medal and was a two-time silver medalist in 2000 and 2001, only losing by the slightest of margins and never getting submitted. His performances at the ADCC would see him utilize the first half of the match with no points to continually hunt for submission. His hooking and overhooking arms to attack while on the bottom came from his amniotic band syndrome, which left him without fingers on his left hand. Instead of relying on collar or sleeve grips, he used his arms to hug and control. The years of playing these grips in the gi gave him a distinct advantage over most competitors who needed to adjust their games for the lack of control no gi offered. Jean-Jacques' signature submissions were the triangle choke and arm lock, which he would either set up from butterfly guard or even from mount. Most of his combinations came from a side-to-side -side sweep to submission attack. Sweep to the left, if they defend, attack the right. This proved very effective even at the highest levels and against the elite of ADCC. Machado would go on to train another ADCC standout in Eddie Bravo, contributing to a revolution in the sport of no-gi grappling. Now a coral belt, this great technician teaches in Los Angeles where he still works to develop jiu-jitsu today.